well, the EU accession is not a race, it's a merit-based process and every, every applicant country, every candidate country is encouraged to do their best in order to move ahead as fast as they can and as effectively as they can because in the end it's for their own benefit and for the benefit of their people. On the first part of your question, of course, we welcome the nomination uh, by Parliament of uh, an appointment of the three constitutional court judges because this is a step forward for the democracy in Montenegro and also for Montenegro's EU perspective. Um, restoring a fully operational and fully functioning constitutional court is essential for the stability and functionality of democratic institutions. And we invite and we expect the parliament in Montenegro to find consensus to nominate also the fourth judge in the upcoming second round of, of the vote to fill the remaining vacancy in the court and ensure a fully functioning judiciary in the country. And only to recall on, on this topic, it was just before Christmas when High Representative Borrell mandated the foreign ministers of Austria and Slovenia to go to Podgorica to deal exactly with these issues. Well, this is not for us. What we expect from Montenegro is to, to keep up the efforts and to continue to advance the EU-linked reforms because they are important for, for uh, ensuring that the EU perspective of the country is, is, is followed and that the benefits of the EU accession will be felt by the citizens in Montenegro uh, as soon as it gets. Are there other questions on enlargement for Peter? Enlargement? Enlargement? 